guys and welcome back to another M Creator tutorial. So I just wanted to quickly do a short video, hopefully it won't be too long, but uh, on how to test for different weather conditions and stuff like that. Uh, 1.17 and under had a different method of doing it where 1.8 takes a little bit into consideration some different values for uh, thunder and stuff like that. So we'll be building the procedure from scratch. Uh, it might be a, maybe a 10 minute video, I don't know, but um, I'll try to stick to the topic and stuff. So if we uh, grab an if statement, what we need to do is we need to place that down here. Now this can be pretty much done on any procedure system, like any trigger that you want, uh, as long as it has a uh, world and X, Y, and Z support, I think. So if we have an if statement, you're gonna need four options. So what you wanna do is you want to set it for the, um, click on the gear icon and then basically set else if, else if, and then else if again. Um, you don't need a other condition for the else for it to fail generally, but um, if you wanna add like a, something down there, you can if you want to. Uh, then what we need to do is go to the world data and we're going to scroll down until we see a couple different procedures is raining now this is going to basically test if the world is currently raining so um this is different than thundering uh very different than thundering thundering has to do with um like the actual thunder and stuff like that where the raining is a completely different mechanic for that so we're going to actually have to make an and statement for both of these uh, we're going to test um, by just grabbing the light blue operator for the equal sign and then we're going to change that to an and statement by clicking on the equal sign and we're going to test if um, it is raining and we're going to test, we're going to go back and grab is thundering. So generally, this is one of the options that you would have with the 1.71. Now, we, what we want to do is we want to duplicate that. And we're going to put that down here. But this time, what we're going to do is we're going to test if it's not thundering. Now, this is, again is the same. I'll go through each one for the 1.17 version that is supported. And then I'll basically describe the 1.18. So lastly, what we want to do is we want to test if it is not raining. So again, these are the ones, this is a system that you would basically use for the 1.17. You would basically run your event inside of these particular uh, versions. This was pretty much for any version 1.17 and below. Uh, however, recently I noticed that 1.18 uh, has some changes to the weather system and it is now possible that it can rain but not or it could be thundering but not raining. So you also have to add a condition for that or your test will fail. Um, I'm not sure why it takes that in consideration now when it doesn't actually sound like it's thundering or anything like that, but it does. So again, you just have to add that extra block, basically invert the is not thundering to thundering and is not raining. So that's pretty much the only thing that you need to do for that. Um, again, uh, how this basically works is we're testing for two different things. Uh, we're testing for the if it's raining and thundering if it's not that then what we're doing is we're testing if it's just raining and not thundering if it is uh not raining but thundering and then finally if it's not raining or thundering so basically the and basically means that both of these conditions have to be true and both of our conditions are not going to be is testing if it's not true so uh, that's what the not statement is for so hopefully that helps a little bit and it's a little bit of a shorter video um one of the things that i noticed with um cctv craft when i was creating the solar panel on 1.18 is that this little block here needed to be added for the system to work before it was just these three like that but um it seemed that maybe some weather stuff was changed in 1.18. But outside of that, if you're new to my channel, don't forget to subscribe, comment down below, rate the video, and I will see you guys next time. Thanks for watching. Peace out.